Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. My name is Jennifer. So, I got a question. Um, do y'all have those things that you know you need to get done, but you just keep putting it off and putting it off and putting it off? Yeah, well, me too. I'm making a video today. Um, my kitchen island, which is where I store all my baking supplies, my cake decorating supplies, my cookie cutters, literally everything I need to bake and decorate is in, in my island or underneath my um other shelf, which I organized that a few months ago. I showed that to y'all on Instagram. If you're not following me, I have the link down below. But um, anyway, we gotta do something about this island. I've been in the mood to bake for a few weeks now, but I just, I'll come in here and open up the door when the drawers on the island i'm just like yeah no we're not baking today nope mm -mm. y'all can settle for some uh cookies out the cabinet or something <laughs> but um yeah and another reason it's almost halloween which is one of my favorite times of year so i want to try to do halloween hot cocoa bombs this year y'all know i've done those last year for christmas and they're really good they were a big hit in my area um as well as I want to start doing some decorated sugar cookies but I can't do it with the island the way it is so that's what we're about to tackle it's bad um I went to Dollar Tree right here Dollar Tree and Dollar General and bought a bunch of little things to organize with you know you can't organize without a trip to Dollar Tree so I'm about to show y'all everything I got from there and uh I'm about to show y'all how bad this island is so this is what i got from dollar tree um i got this little container just to store sprinkles in um i'm probably going to store sprinkles in these three right here i picked these up from dollar general these three right here come from dollar general the rest of this stuff here come from dollar tree um the girl, girl's gonna break this one so got another one right here i'll be using all these in my island i'm not sure i probably put my um uh, my food coloring in here and probably my brushes my brushes and stuff in here i'm not sure what else i'm gonna use the other stuff for we'll see we'll figure it out as we go behind door number one is that's food cooling on there, y'all. It's okay. Um, I had my paint brushes in this, my decorating paint brushes. I had my edible markers in there, and just that is the state of this. Like cake pop straws. Door number two is just as bad. Cookie cutters. What time is this? So, here. Hobby Lobby bag. Melting chips. More melting chocolate. Almond flour. Molds. Same thing in here, molds and stuff. These are some um, cookie cutters that I ordered and more stuff. Cookie cutters. Till my lungs 
lungs give out your beautiful Right about here is when I started feeling really, really, really overwhelmed. But you know what? I pushed through it and I got it all done. I wanna put you in that spotlight. Looking at you all night, all night. I'll sing until my lungs give out your beautiful. So I tried to get all my food coloring to fit into this little container, but it didn't work. So I had to switch it out for the longer one that I had.
It's a remedy, a remedy. If you're wondering what these are these are flavors i like to use them for my candied apples and candy grapes but you can pretty much use them for anything when you're baking this is one of those containers i picked up at dollar tree um you can see there's not a lot of sprinkles left in those bottles so i'm just going to dump them out into that container just to save some space Once again, I'm just doing the same thing here, putting sprinkles into these small stackable containers to save space. Slow. 
like all done. Have my icing tips in here. Some cupcake liners. My little notes that go on my um, hot cocoa bombs. Popping bags. And here is like all my tools that I use. My scale, some measuring cups, my fondant roller, um, icing smoothers, silicone mats, fondant smoothers. These are um, things that I use to level out the top of my cakes. Um, I got some yeast packets in here. <clears throat> Over here, I have my food markers, fondant tools, my um, candy apple thermometer, well, candy thermometer, my stickers that I put on my boxes. This is a torch that I like to use to like roast marshmallows and stuff. This is what I used on my um, s'mores to roast the marshmallows. Down here, oh gosh, is all of my molds. I have a ton of molds and mats. There's more molds over here. There's more, sorry, someone was calling me, but there's more molds over here. There's a mermaid mold, a skull mold my kill bought me the other day, heart molds, brain molds, you name it. I got it. <laughs> Plenty of molds. This drawer here is dedicated just to cake pops. Um, I got all my milk and chocolate, my wafers, um, K-pop straws, K-pop molds, more food coloring that I had. This is the paint um, to do painting. Like, um, if I want to paint on the K-pop, that's what this is for. More K-pop sticks. And this is probably my favorite drawer. <laughs> um, so I had to put all the sprinkles down here because this drawer comes out more than the top sprinkle, um, top drawer does. I am obsessed with this drawer. It's so pretty and colorful. So have all my sprinkles in here, my flavors, more sprinkles over here. Just tons of sprinkles. Got luster dust. Well, not luster dust. This is edible glitter. More edible glitter, ice and sugar, so, all kinds of stuff in here. Like I said, this is probably my favorite drawer. And then this drawer is all of my um, cookie cutters. <laughs> I got some flavoring in here. I got my meringue powder for my royal icing, as well as some uh, modeling chocolate right there. Yeah. That's it. All right, y'all. It is done. <laughs> I will never, ever, hopefully, fingers crossed, ever let it get that bad again. Told y'all it was bad, but it's good now. It's good. Um, maybe Saturday while I'm killing the girls are out deer hunting, I can enjoy some time to myself and bake. Maybe I can put some of those new cookie cutters to use. I don't know. But hopefully this motivated one of y'all somewhere to organize something in your kitchen or your bedroom or your bathroom. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.